yes, it's uh, APN 201 design unboxing of new stuff. Part one. Is, I've been really creative the uh, past two weeks and I've been uh, making new prototypes of my old designs and making some completely new designs and now we will see what we have. Lots of really long uh, sipping note, lots of popcorn. First one. A crossbow modeled after uh, Leonardo da Vinci's giant crossbow. This part should move, but it ceased, so we probably break this. Fuck, it needs some. The trigger mechanism is working. Maybe there is a trigger. This one should be moving, but it's not. Fuck. Okay. Let's see it later. This one is a stand for my atomic bomb, which is not ready yet. So I have ordered a ceramic uh, 3D print of a little boy atomic bomb which uh, hopefully will come in the next batch and this is just a stand to keep it like a table oh, this is cool this is Nefertiti this is a previous can which was done secretly they took a Xbox what is called the the motion sensor bar, what the hell it's called, kinetic, and they scanned a Nefertiti statue in Museum of Germany secretly, and they published the 3D design for free, and that is uh, like a Voronoi, Voronoi sculpture of the real design. This. I used to play Ultima 4 and some of the Ultimas when I was young. I was actually thinking to get this in metal, but this is now in plastic as a prototype. So this is a Voronoi of the Ankh. And this is fully my own design. It's not Ankh that I took somewhere. I actually drew it myself. I made quite cool lace like a Voronoi design. Ah, oh, bird's nest. This is a bracelet. It's really delicate. It's almost like some kind of spider web or uh, ivory. It's, uh, I think I was using 0.7mm, which is the smallest wire that is possible in uh, safe ways. And it's beautiful, but it looks really fragile. This is another Voronoi texture that I... I was playing around with this Voronoi, as you can see. This is um, Hurricane Katrina. This is from a um, model from NASA. Hurricane Katrina model. Uh, also Voronoi, but it's almost like a solid because it was so small. Also, I'm planning to treat this with uh, epoxy and then maybe paint it. Small pendant about the Hurricane Katrina. Lots of shit. Do we have more? Some uh, metallic stuff. Oh, this is a silver printout of the uh, 
the dog tag or identification plate of uh, Second World War, continuation war in Atkolota in Finland. So this is a design that I made long ago, but I, I printed it in plastic. Uh, so this is a silver with a custom text, so the user can change the text. This is now my uh, social security number. It looks a little bit like a razor plate, but it's a silver ID plate, dog tag. Oh yeah. This one uh, is the centerpiece for my pendant that I printed earlier in silver. This is in the polished brass, APN, with the uh, anchor wings. Really, really cool. Let's put it there. Oh, what is this? Mm. This is the new version of Kupunen, uh, the finger thingy, it's a statue, but it can be used as a adult toy, I guess. This was a proof uh, ceramic, really cool. Uh, and yeah, really cool, white, very good ceramic. Oh, this is a plastic version of a nuclear weapon. So I will get the ceramic version hopefully later. Uh, but this is heavy. This is supposed to be really thin, but maybe there is some uh, stuff inside. Come on, let's agree. A little nuclear weapon. This one is, uh, I was just playing with the tolerance uh, things. So this is a uh, couple of, uh, yeah, maybe this could be printed in, in metal, but it's not really. Yeah, there is too much uh, tolerance and the plastic is too flexible, but anyway, it's like a spinner. So you can spin it this and this and the thing in the middle is spinning as well. Yeah, quite cool uh, spinner printed in one go. And this one is a cool one. I had problems with this design for a long time. Um, I used to be a big fan of Phantom, you know, the comic, and uh, he has the sign of a uh, good uh, in his fin uh, like a ring. This is a model after the Phantom Scoot sign. And uh, I made a couple of those ID plates also in steel. The problem there is that the minimum uh, print depth was 3 mm, so I needed to make like a 1 mm uh, fake. Uh, Dot here on the other side, hopefully I can remove it somehow. This is in Suomi, Finland. This is from Talvisota, the other board of the two continuous boards and winter board. Uh, that is similar in the nickel steel uh, from continuation board. to be used as an electrode for um, making a clock out of lemon so it's a rhodium plated um, brass or whatever it should be highly good in the in the electro pair making electricity if we use something really different metal as a pair um, galvanic Still should be 
something. So, that's it, I think.